Okay, so we got to talk about another Christmas review other than The Grinch. <laughs> so, The Grinch Stole Christmas or whatever it's called, yeah. This Dr. Seuss took The Grinch Stole Christmas, well, this was the Jim Carrey version. Carrey version, whatever you want to call it. Um, I have to say this is probably one of the better Christmas movies I watched because not only was it somewhat of a good storyline for, for kids, it was more of a kids movie though, but it also had incredibly good Blu-ray for a transfer and stuff like that. Usually when you watch a Blu-ray movie, it's a Christmas movie that you pick up on physical copy, you always have a problem with the transfer not looking quite like it should be, or at least better than what it is. You watch the Santa Claus movies, the Blu-rays look horrible. <laughs> and if you watch other movies such as um, Bad Moms, I told you it was horrible. Christmas Story was horrible. It seems like most Christmas movies get a bad transfer. I'm trying to look at some other ones. Um, let me tell you right here, Bad Santa wasn't a good Blu-ray. The 4K was okay for a Blu-ray, but like I said, there was no HDR in it. Um, Christmas the Pranks I haven't watched yet. Home Alone Blu-ray was nothing remarkable. Um, um, HDR slash 4K wasn't remarkable. Christmas Vacation was okay. Planes, Trains, and Automobiles was okay. And Arnold Schwarzenegger, Jingle All the Way, was a VHS, so that's standard definition. All I'm going to say is, is the Grinch and Jim Carrey is one hell of a character. He's played, there goes a screensaver, he's played so many great characters over the years that, um, you can't complain about the guy. He puts his time into his characters, too. It's not like he's a boring guy. That does, he's not a bad actor. I mean, no one can say that. Um, if you want to watch this movie right now, you can pick it up on Blu-ray. There are other different versions, like the animated version. And there's also, um, I think there's another version of The Grinch Who Stole Christmas, but it's a different kind of movie. Or is it just animated? I don't know. You can pick it up probably for a good less than 10 bucks now when the movie's so old. I don't even know when it was made. <laughs> I, I remember a few, several years ago, more than three or four years ago, someone got it for me out of, um, what's it called? One of those discount buckets for Black Friday. So it was only like a few bucks. Unfortunately now, Black Friday, if there's any deals, there's nothing to do with movies. And they still have movies at Walmart everywhere. I don't know what they're going to do with them once they discontinue everything. All right, that's it. Bye-bye.